church's YouTube page uh, later today. I'm going to be doing a scripture like prayer today, and I'm going to be reading from the book of Psalms, Psalm chapter 33, verses 4 through 12. Psalm chapter 33, verses 4 through 12. For the word of the Lord is upright, and all his work is done in faithfulness. He loves righteousness and justice. The earth is full of the steadfast love of the Lord. By the word of the Lord the heavens were made, and by the breath of his mouth all their hosts. He gathers the waters of the sea as a heap. He puts the deeps in storehouses. Let all the earth fear the Lord. Let all the inhabitants of the world stand in awe of him. For he spoke and it came to be. He commanded and it stood firm. The Lord brings the counsel of the nations to nothing. He frustrates the plans of the peoples. The counsel of the Lord stands forever. The plans of his heart to all generations. Blessed is the nation whose God is the Lord, the people whom he has chosen as his heritage. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, Lord God, we come to you once again in the name of Jesus, Father God. We humbly come before you, Father God. We come in submission to you today, Lord God, in the throne of grace. And we want to say thank you, Lord God, for another day. Thank you, Lord God, when we have the privilege of coming to worship you, oh God. And Lord God, that your word is upright, Lord God. Lord, your word is truth, Lord God. Lord God, that heaven and earth shall pass but your word shall never pass away. Lord God, and help us to store your word in our hearts so we might not sin against you, oh God. Lord God, and all that your work is done in faithfulness, Father God. For Father God, that you formed our inward parts, Father God. Lord, you knitted us together in our mother's wombs, Father God. And Lord God, we're fearfully and wonderfully made, Father God. Lord God, that you are, have shown all faithfulness to us, Lord. And you firmly adhere to your promises, Lord God. Lord God, that we are bound to you, Father God. We have a binding relationship with you, oh God. We just love you, Father God. Lord, and you love righteousness and justice, Father God. Father God, for our sake, you made him to be sin who knew no sin so that we might become the righteousness of God. Father God, that if we practice righteousness, that we are born of you, oh God. We praise you, Father God.
to die on the cross for the sins of mankind, to be buried and to be resurrected from the dead, and believing in that, that we will have eternal life, Father God. And we pray right now for all of the nations of the world, all the leaders of the nations of the world, all peoples, Lord God. Lord God, our family, our friends, our co-workers, anyone that we come into contact with that do not know you, Father God. But Lord, that they would come to know that salvation is faith alone in your Son, Jesus Christ, O oh God. Father God, we praise you, Father God. You have the name that is above all names, that by the name of Jesus, that every knee shall bow and every tongue shall confess that, that you are the Lord, Father God, in heaven and on earth and under the earth, Lord God, to the glory of God the Father. Lord, we just praise you. We give thanks. We ask you to forgive us of our sins, Father God. Forgive us when we haven't done what you called us to do, Lord God. Lord God, we come right now and we confess our sins to you, Lord God, and we pray and we ask you to cleanse us from all unrighteousness, Lord God. Father God, we pray over the morning worship, worship service this time here right now. Lord, we pray for every ministry that's represented here today, Lord God, from the usher ministry, Lord God, to the praise and worship team, Lord God, is going to sing and glorify you, Lord God, and the music ministry, Lord God, to the sound ministry, Lord God, and to the man of God is going to bring the word today, Lord God. Let the words of his mouth and the meditation of his heart be acceptable in your sight, for you are his strength and his redeemer. Lord God, we praise you, we love you, Father God, we thank you for this opportunity to worship you, Lord God, and we pray and we ask all of these things in the name of Jesus Christ. We pray and we give thanks. Amen.